Hello ladies and gents, my name is John, and welcome back to another video. I have not uploaded in months. I think uh, August was the last time I uploaded. I'm not too sure about that. So, uh, yeah, this is uh, Darth Vader's castle from Rogue One, and I believe it's going to be uh, a feature of an upcoming Marvel comic, so that'll be pretty cool. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty proud of this because most of my builds, I kind of skimp out on them, such as a Scarif, Kessel... Uh, Baradur, the, uh, tower from Lord of the Rings, a couple other ones. Helm's Deep was another one that I had built them in one day, so they were pretty rushed, and while I did build this one in one day, uh, I think the quality of it is far better than a lot of the other builds I did. Uh, it's pretty accurate, especially considering how, uh, kind of restricted and constrained the angles were in the uh, the actual movie were so it's hard to get uh, valid reference material also this uh other than hogwarts this is the second time i've used uh, world painter as kind of a feature of a build and not done it with world edit and uh with a sand brush and i think this turned out really well uh vader's castle is kind of on a ridge so that's kind of you know how i got this ongoing the only uh, kind of downsides to it are a no interior, two it's scaled down a little bit because of the uh, height limit, and also this back section I had to take a little bit of a artistic license on, as a you know there's only one shot of it in the movie that shows the back and it's kind of difficult to interpret that in Minecraft form so I just kind of had this little waterfall go waterfall lava fall going down and. I went a little bit overboard with this lava, there's not as much in the film, but uh, other than that, I think for the most part, it's pr pretty accurate. Um, what actually convinced me to build this was, I received it as a gift for Christmas, the uh, Lego version, which is in front of me right now, it's pretty cool. Um, even though that's not very accurate, so I couldn't go off of it for reference material, but I don't know what else I have to say about it. I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, it being black kind of takes away from the details, so I'll just go up close to kind of show the more fine aspects of the, uh, the actual build itself, which if you look at any picture of Darth Vader's castle, you could kind of uh, appreciate more. But yeah, anyways, I'm just going to have a short time lapse. This isn't going to be a, a main feature video. I just kind of wanted to get something out there and show that I'm not done with YouTube. Uh, you know, because I haven't uploaded in a really long time. Um, so yeah, don't have anything else to say about it. We'll get into the time lapse and see you in the next video.